Hey guys, it's Joe from Heating Up. Uh, coming back at you with a, another review. It is Tuesday. Hope everyone's doing well today, wherever you're at. Um, I got a sauce review. I already did. I didn't. I did my full Robbie at Doomberry on my way to work, and then uh, gave a couple of my coworkers like one drop each, and they thought they were gonna die. And so I made them feel better and did another full Robbie at Doomberry. So. I think I'm tinctured out for the day, which uh, maybe I'll do some later, I don't know. But I have a sauce that I've been waiting to try from um, Mr. David Guillard, I believe is um, how you pronounce that. If I'm mispronouncing that, I apologize, sir. Uh, he is out of, it says Ocala, Florida here. This is Banana Man's Condiments Dollar Taco Sauce uh, Cilantro. I've heard so many good things about this, um, watching reviews and whatnot. So I believe that Keith Nichols um, and Andrew Miller just did this sauce on their uh, channel. They just reviewed it. So uh, sorry about being late to the game, David, but um, appreciate your package today. I got another sauce of yours and uh, a bottle of tincture. So I will be reviewing both of those as well. Um, but this is, uh, like I said, the dollar taco sauce and cilantro. The ingredients on this, uh, white wine and distilled vinegar blend, red savina peppers, sweet onion, fresh cilantro, that's great, love cilantro. Garlic cloves, tomato paste, lime juice, salt, cumin, oregano, garlic powder, and black pepper. And it says heat level four out of five and uh, refrigerate after opening. It was bottled on February 6th of this year. So yeah, I uh, hope everyone's doing well. Uh, shout out, as always, to Mr. Rhett Grizzly Heat Griffin. Um, definitely need to do that Zoom call, brother. Hopefully you and Keith Nichols can uh, get that together and uh, we'll go from there. So I, uh, we're gonna open this up. Uh, Steve Gillespie, great guy, Heat My Shorts. He uh, did a review of Nick Kemp's, uh, I believe it was Strawberry Jolly Rancher today. Um, I've yet to try the Jolly Rancher tinctures. Um, I think the next round I'm gonna buy is gonna be uh, the Jolly Rancher. Uh, I love the strawberry. I still wanna try the, the uh, Electric Funeral as well. I have the powder. I have not tried that yet. Uh, but I have not tried the tincture, so it's lots of stuff I want to try. So the consistency on this, I have a feeling this is going to be such a great sauce on tacos, and I'm knowing how much Silas loves tacos, this probably won't last long. I'm going to open her up, like that sound, and give it a smell. Wow. It smells just like taco seasoning and uh, it smells like a Mexican restaurant. It's amazing. Hopefully it tastes as good as it smells because if it does, this bottle will not last too much longer. And I don't know if Sal's going to get any. Just kidding, bud. You can have some. So there's the consistency. I will not be tainting today. Johnny Scoville's Chase the Heat Mother of Pearl Spoon. You can find it at uh, chasetheheat.com. I will leave a link in the description below. And you can find uh, David Guillard, Banana Man Condiments, uh, I believe on Facebook. I'm not sure if uh, he has a website up and running yet. If he does, I apologize, David, but um, I connected with him on Facebook, so um, give it a little copyrighted, patented, Shake, shake. Mm, smells delicious. Oh, here is the pour. Love that consistency. All right, I am Joe. This is heating up. Cheers.
so good. Get the fresh, fresh cilantro vinegars. I don't believe I've had a Savina pepper, so can't tell you if I'm tasting that or not. Uh, taste the oregano, the onion. This is delicious. I don't know, did I have tomato paste? Cause I t yep, I definitely taste the tomato paste. Wow, David, that's great. <laughs> Excellent. This bottle won't last long. Probably won't last a week. Obviously, it's going to be great on tacos. Uh, this will be excellent uh, on scrambled eggs or any egg, an omelet. That's... My wife says I need to start eating breakfast, so... Um, I got so many sauces I can put on breakfast food. It's amazing, but yeah, this is... Spot on flavor 10 out of 10 all day, David. Great job. Mm. That is so good. One more and then I'm done. I could kill this whole bottle right now. Not even joking. Not even joking, sir. So, yeah, that was my review of Banana Man condiments, Dollar Taco Sauce, Cilantro, David Guillard. Check him out on Facebook. I'll uh, put a link in the description for his page and a link in the description for Johnny Scoville's Chase the Heat's Mother of Pearl Spoon. If you have not gotten yours yet, what are you waiting for, for real? Um, yeah, so that's gonna be my review today. I'm gonna head back to work. Um, just wanted to give thanks to everybody that's uh, subscribed to me and Silas's channel and uh, we will definitely be getting the little man on here soon. Um, I got the Death Nut 3.0 that I'm thinking I want to do um, maybe, maybe Friday this week. Yeah, I'm not going to say yes or no, but um, definitely Friday. It's a two-player version apparently so I don't know uh, we'll, we'll talk to Silas and see well, actually we'll talk to mama bear and see if uh, that's gonna be a good idea or not but um, anyway uh, yeah I didn't even tell you heat level for me on that maybe it one um, it's definitely got it's got a little burn if you don't ever eat anything hot it's gonna be up there four or five maybe six um, but I, like I said I just I did two Robbie droppers uh, in the last three hours so uh, I'm thinking my tolerance right now is higher than it was when I come to work so um, but anyway uh, that was my review of David Guillard's banana man condiments check him out um, I'll leave a link in the description and hopefully everybody is safe where they're at having a great day give someone you love a hug tell them you love them and this is Joe from Heating Up. I will catch you on the next one.